e-tutor tt pioneering your future we have question 33 so which of the following markets typically found where there is a large number of producers and consumers right so as i said it has to do with a market structure and we have perfect market right so you see sometimes they repeat the questions repeat yourself right mm -hmm. right so you see you said 33 right um to the, the price of an article is usually high when there is so this has to do with demand and supply right as well as pricing right so this is on the topic demand and supply and the answer here is d so when the price of an article or item is usually high it's because there's a small quantity for sale and many people want to buy it right so is um Yes, it's any product, right? Which will cause high demand and many people will want to purchase it. Okay? This uh -huh. is on the top of the demand and supply. Then you have, you said 35. Yeah. Which of the following may cause the bank to dishonor a check? So when a dishonor check is more is similar to a bounce check, right? So you have different reasons why the check will be dishonored. You have like insufficient funds, irregular signature, irregular date, boots and figures don't match, right? So we have check to be cross. If the check is cross, the, the depending on who the banker is, sometimes they made a son on the check, the regular signature, right? Um, and the check is both treated, right? So these are just some reasons why the son are check. So you look at business finance and you will get that answer there. Right? Um, then you have 37, you said, right? Which are the following and the characteristics of the stock market? So we have the stock market where you have the ability to sell shares. And usually the stock market, there's a lot of high risk, but you also get high rewards, right? So here, the immense, the characteristics will be risk and benefits. Right, based on the stock market. Okay. Um, you said thirty-eight. Right. So Tom invests his savings by buying shares in a company. From this investment, Tom expects to receive. So when you have a return from purchasing shares, that return is called a dividend. Okay. Mm -hmm. 